Greetings. Come to look over my spring collection, perhaps? Glad to take a glance at what you got. Of course, please do. If anything chafes or pinches, I can alter it on the spot at no charge. Once I'm done, it'll feel like you're wearing nothing at all. Wouldn't mind a few rounds of cards.
at home. Track mudded all over me floors. Maybe she'll finally move in with him. High time. Oh my, certainly took my request to heart. Mean you weren't being serious? Still got time to change. Don't you dare. You look great. You get everything? Everything's ready. We can go. A shame events like this are so rare. Without them, I'd never get to see you dressed up. Uh, damn, doublets chafing my armpits. And it feels like they sewed wires into this. I'll be sure to admire your valiant suffering the whole time. Well then, shall we go? Greetings, my lord, my lady. We're Lady Ingrid Vagelbud's guests. Your invitation, please. All's in order. You'll find Lady Vagelbud in the estate's yard. Look for the parrot mask. Uh, one more thing. Uh, leave your swords here, please. Must be some mistake. You know why we're here, don't you? Of course. But I've orders to make certain every guest enters the estate unarmed. Damn it. A pleasant evening to you both. It's beautiful here. I haven't been outside the city in ages. Well? Well? <laughs> How could he? With that scrawny harlot! Come now, don't cry. After all, he's not the only man in the world. But Hello, Baronet. No use pretending you don't know. Is that any way to treat an old mate? Refuse to acknowledge him? There's been a mistake. I don't know you, sir. Don't be foolish, Vivian. I'd recognize that mane anywhere. 
You might play the great dame now, but before that Baron Edward something pulled you from the gutter, you were a common. Enough. The lady said she doesn't know you. Who's this? The new one? Older than the last, it seems. A decrepit, moss-covered prick. So, the less they can, the more they pay. Is that it? You asked for it. What? Nothing happened. Time to invest in rubies. Mercy! Bath, sorry, I've so had I highly recommend you visit. My husband's a supervisor by trade. <laughs> I'm a kraken! <laughs> Moritz, what are you doing here? Little Miss Miracle. Well, well. And I was led to believe this would be an elegant affair. Yes, I missed you too. But can we put that aside for now? Do you have a way out of Novigrad? You can join us if you want. Join you? And just who would I join? Your friends, among others. Once we've all gathered, I'll lead you. You will lead? Forgive me, Marigold, but that is like allowing myself to be led by a lame duck. Farewell. Didn't like that guy. Why do you insist on talking to him? He's an old friend. His name's Moritz Dyfenthal. Tell you the story later. Oh. Let's look around. Word is he's made some enemies. Turned to Joel finally. Must have thought he'd get a second chance. No one will notice in this crowd. How dare you! Have you tried the quail baking cranberry? No more. I couldn't possibly take another bite. He's not been seen around town. Got banners from the city walls. You are the famed Geralt of Rivia, are you not? Stuck him right in the pocket. <laughs> well done, old chap. I'm not just some old shot. I'm a Time to invest in rubies. Ooh. I told him off. 
Excuse me a moment. Miss? Yes, it's me. The trout buyer? Hmm? Oh, yes, of course. Please excuse the precautions, but perhaps we could speak somewhere in private. Thank you for agreeing to help. My valet warned me you might come with a friend. I'd prefer as few as possible knew of Albert's flight, but if you trust this man... Like no one else. Let's get Albert. Where is he? Entertaining the guests. He's always been an outsized presence at my receptions. I preferred not to arouse any suspicions. When can we take him away? We shall have to wait until the guests have imbibed enough to notice only the goblet-laden trays. Don't fret. It won't be long. How will we recognize him? He's donned a panther mask. He knew you were due to come for him. Seemed rather excited, ironically. I'm afraid he's not fully comprehended the danger he faces. As I said, he's not terribly bright. Don't worry about that. He'll fit right in with a good number of the other mages. Geralt! Let's go find him. I shall await word from you. Let's look for Albert. Excuse it. Behave yourself. Do what you must, Mr. Puffy Head. You'll not find much to do in Novigrad. You are the famed Geralt of Rivia, are you? Right in the <laughs> well, tunnel, chap. I'm not just some old shot. I'm a cat. Sure, I don't. Clear day, you can see no dark banners from the city of Rio. Your reputation proceeds from Kevin. Yes. Albert Vagelbud? No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a black panther. <laughs> oh, my count! <laughs> Your mom sent us, Mr. Panther. Oh, so you are. Yes, when can we leave the estate? Well, Mama said it would be best to wait until everyone's drunk. Besides, there'll be fireworks later, a jolly good distraction. Once they've begun, I shall slip away, saunter into the garden. We'll meet in the hedge maze. Be waiting for you there. Very well. But first, you absolutely must try the Fiorano Rosé. Absolutely. Hope Albert hasn't forgotten the reason for this whole get-together. You wanna wait in the garden? I saw a nice spot there earlier. 
Mark my words, I'll kick Sir. him out. Gregor, have you seen Durgoff? Just a moment ago... Oh, apologies. I mistook you for my friend, sir. He wears a similar mask. General Voris. Geralt of Rivia. So, oh, I was not entirely mistaken. Pleasure, as always. This is... A beautiful and mysterious lady. Let us leave the formalities to the event's end, when all will remove their masks. More fun that way, wouldn't you agree? I would, sir. And now I must beg your pardon. I really must find Durgoff, and quickly. A lovely evening to you both. The second sword. Is it in case uh. the first one breaks? <laughs> Smart. On a clear day, you can see Nilfgaard's banners from the city walls. Looking for me, sir? Time to invest in your piece. way. I am not... Ah, another challenger. Please join us. Sir Devonan just vacated his place at the table. It's rather unlikely he'll be back. What happened to him? Some good men took him aside to prevent him from hurting himself. So, shall we play? First, you shall face Margrave Vladimir de Cray. The man can afford to lose, so he's likely to be reckless. Let's do it.
Now you must win it back. First, you shall face Margrave Vladimir de Cray. The man can afford to lose, so he's likely to be reckless. Let's do it. On a clear day, you can see Nilfgaard's banners from the city walls. Now you must win it back. First, you shall face Margrave. The man can afford to lose, so... Not in the mood. <laughs> Not in the mood to win. The second sword. Is it in case the first one breaks? Smart. Care to sit down for a spell? Well? Relieved to get that mask off, if only for a little. Great view from here, and there's even wine. It's been so long since I've been to a feast, ball, or reception. An amazingly pleasant change from the sewers of Novigrad. So, does this mean it's a good time to ask you about... Yes? About that mage we met earlier? Ah, oh, Moritz. What do you want to know? Got the impression he doesn't exactly like you. I just think he'd love to have me as his charge, rather than his leader. See, but you're the one organizing the mage's escape from Novigrad. 
Sometimes I have no idea how I actually managed to bring them all together. You're a charismatic leader. Simple as that. You really think so? Absolutely. Next thing you know, they'll be calling you Iron Marigold. Could even wear an eye patch and it'd look right. <laughs> For a moment there, I thought you were being sincere. Of course I'm being sincere. Look at me. Didn't blush a bit. <laughs> Someone's coming. <laughs> Is it Albert? No, just some lost guest. Shh. must be looking for his beloved. Like in that elven tale about the frog and the lark. Inchu, inchu, biag broga. Inch by inch, little frog. <laughs> Shh, let's go. Oh. I sure hope the other guests don't get drunk as quickly as I did. Sooner we get out of here, the better. Oh, no. I plan to have a good look at this famous maze of theirs first. I hear the statues there are completely, entirely... Entirely what? Newt! <laughs> come on, Geralt! Triss, wait! Geralt! Coming? Careful. Miss Marigold, at last! So sorry we are forced to meet under such incredibly inopportune circumstances. You can say that again. But I'm sure we'll make up for it another time. I absolutely must show you my alchemical formulae. Anyone follow you? I don't believe so. Just in case, you two switch masks. We'll go first. Garrett will follow right after. Saddled horses await in the stables. Good. Meet you there. circumstances, I'd give you the full Monty. Oh, I, I'm sorry, I... Albert Vagelhood. Please, step away, miss. Nobility's not towards you, Count. Try anything, and you will get bruised. Mm, doubt it.
let's end this. Yes, yes. Oh, I've begun to worry. Ran into some trouble. Hunters? Will they come here? No, we've got some time. But please send someone to the garden. Needs a little tidying. I shall see to it. And you must hurry. Everything set? Yes. Got your swords back from the guard. And Ingrid gave me the coin. It's, uh, it's more than I expected. Stunningly more, frankly. Glad I could help you collect it. You'll find a good use for it. What happened at the fountain? It was my fault. I know. The, the wine went straight to my head. I'm sorry. Triss, don't apologize. Miss Marigold. We need to go. I know. Be careful. <laughs> 